Okay. So right now we're going to show you how to flay perch. Now we got these two perch yesterday. This one's 13, this one's 10 and 3 quarters. Both keepers, both real nice one. This one's real big. Um, <clears throat> what you're going to need is you're going to need a cutting board, a fillet knife, something to put your scraps in. Okay, so right now what you want to do is you're going to want to grab your perch, lay it out on your board. You take your fillet knife, you're going to grab the perch like this. It's a good way to grab it. You're going to stick your fillet knife up and under that back fin. And you're going to cut down. Like so. And then you're going to come across. And it's nice if you have a flexible fillet knife. So that way you can get right along that spine. And then you get a lot of meat off of it. We're going to come down here. We're going to stop just barely a little bit short. And we're going to flip. And this one is a female. We're going to pull all that crud out of there. That's right there. We're going to pull all that crud out. And throw it in our bag. Then we're going to take our knife. And we're going to cut. We're going to try and go right along the skin. As best as we can. I'm just going to keep flipping it back and just making sure. And I might have to go in from the back like this. You might have to take it and just go down the back so you can get a good line. You just take all your crud off. Once you get this fillet off, like so, then you're going to take your fillet like this. Push that off to the side. You're going to take it, right? Like this. This is what we got so far. We got this. We sliced it open, we flipped it back, we cut along the skin, we started back here, we grabbed it, now you got your fillet. Now granted this isn't a very big perch, so we're not going to get a whole ton of meat off. So as you grab your fillet, what you're going to want to do now, is you're going to want to take it, and you're going to want to go just above those ribs. And you're just cutting those ribs out. Like so. There's your fillet. Do it like I did the other perch. Cut. Down. In. Because this fish is so giant, you might have to grab it a second time farther up to keep your fillet knife nice. To keep a nice even fillet. Now the perch is a good fish for a lot of stuff. And the best way to cook perch in my book is either beer batter or um you could bread it, fry it. Fish cakes are good. A lot of stuff. I'm just doing that same thing I showed you before. Now I was debating on whether or not to get this fish mounted. So my brother got a perch mounted that wasn't very much bigger than this one. But I decided not to because I really love the taste of perch through the ice. So then this fillet is way thicker, but you're just doing the same process. 
I'm just gonna find that rib bone. Those rib bones. I'm just gonna go right along them. Like so. Now there are many different ways to fillet a fish. This is just the way that I find to be the best way. You get your big fillets. There's more to the keeping process. Here's your big giant, nice, big perch fillets. 